Augmented reality, or AR, is the polar opposite of virtual reality. The idea of AR is, rather than the user immerses in a 3D realistic virtual environment, instead would be enhancing our environment with real-life 3D features. The first AR technology was developed in 1968 at Harvard by computer scientist Ivan Sutherland and was later introduced as a product by big companies such as Microsoft, Apple, Google, and others. AR has been prominently famous around the world, especially in gaming. One particular AR is a game that became so popular around the world back in 2016, and its name is Pokemon Go. It was a major turning point for augmented reality because it has inspired us to improve our daily lives. It was also used in many other categories, say, such as education. navigation and other several features. Gaming has the highest share of the industry's revenue and will remain a relevant driver of augmented reality. Practical uses of AR such as those used by healthcare and engineering industries will also gain traction, with AR's value in the market climbing up to 25 billion by 2025. It'll become 152.3 billion by 2028. The future of augmented reality is bright. This growth will only continue for years to come, determined by investments from business domains and spheres. So far, most AR technologies are only softwares used as apps on our cell phones to entertain or help the users. But there are companies who have developed their own real-life AR technology that's close to its full potential. One of them is Dreamglass. Born from Meta, the Dreamglass device hasn't received alternative attention, but was a refreshing take on mobile AR that's next level, yet affordable. By pairing the Dreamglass visor with an everyday Android smartphone, Users get to access a basic AR computing environment that includes a 6 DOF tracking, hand gesture recognition, a 90 degree diagonal field of view, and a 1080p front facing camera and microphone. In the market, it is priced at 619 With such a low price and easy to deploy setup, the only thing really holding the Dreamless back is marketing and a community of developers devoted to creating software for the system. There are several more companies who have produced the same product, but with their own features. One day, AR may become on par with virtual reality not only as an entertainment, but a new byproduct to our ever-evolving society. One of these years, AR will take the spotlight and shift how we live our daily lives further beyond. My name is Vince Gonzalez of Section AN015A and this is my vlog of augmented reality.